Hello folks, this is Bill at Bill Reddick Outdoors. And I thought I had me some help to launch me a little boat in the pond this afternoon, but they jumped ship on me. <laughs> so I guess I'm just gonna have to come down here and wing it by myself. Loading and unloading boats is a lot of trouble for me these days, so I'm just gonna try to fish from the bank. We also gonna do something a little bit different. It's gonna be a one bait challenge today, and I have this thing right here. <laughs> Y'all, I'm cheap. It ain't even got no name on it. Wait a minute. Maybe it does. Oh, this is a Super Spook Junior. I'm surprised my eyes was good enough to read that. A name brand lure. <laughs> Somebody must have left that in my tackle box. I buy the cheap stuff. I'm trying to do what you call the walk the dog method. I never was real good at it, but the idea behind it is my understanding. You cast this lure out there twitch your rod on a slack line and that lure will dart back and forth sideways they call it walking the dog these fish in this pond must be like me and have a little eyesight trouble <laughs> they keep missing don't come off buddy <laughs> there he is <laughs> tangled up <laughs> well folks I found that little old bass right there <laughs> now y'all see why I don't go much by myself I don't know if I can get this joker off the hook or not come on Bill <laughs> and of course you wouldn't know I come off and forgot a pair of pliers <laughs> But that don't surprise me. My forgetter has been working overtime lately. Let's swap hands and see what that does. <laughs> Success. See you later, buddy. I might better quit while I'm ahead. That was a pretty good job for me. Nah, we're going to try it a little bit longer. <laughs> That's fun. I got my chair. We in business now. Y'all, it's hard for me to understand how some with treble hooks on it like that. And the fish just, whoom, bend your pole over and then spit it out and don't get hooked. They smarter than I am. <laughs> Another little bitty hit. These fish has got the poorest eyesight of any fish I've ever been around. <laughs> I saw one bust of water right over there. I'm gonna try to throw this thing over there pretty close to where it was at. I ought to be able to hit within 20 feet or so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think what it boils down to, a fish is a fish. And they got very little brains, so I can't outthink them. <laughs> I sure do enjoy trying though. <laughs> Y'all ready from one of them old crazy thoughts I have? You know, you've all heard uh, people joking and picking on people about blinker fluid for the car, you know, because people don't use their turn signals. They tell them they need some more blinker fluid. <laughs> well, technically, aren't eye drops blinker fluid? <laughs> <laughs> or what about, have you ever thought about it, the word incorrectly? is spelled incorrectly in every dictionary there is. I believe I was successful on the one bait challenge. As bad as I want to sit here and fish, I'm scared to death that I'm gonna hook one and with my hands the way they are not be able to get them undone. So I think I'm just gonna go on to a house and count my blessings. And always remember folks, whether you at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick, Outdoors. See y'all.